Uh, yeah, I grew up uh, in a good family. My grandparents, they moved here in the 70s for political violence over there. But if you come to America, there's no political violence in America. <laughs> so I've been there for 24 years. Um, but yeah, my family's quite conservative. And, uh, my mother, for example, she was a huge Trump supporter. She was like a, a Trump Shiite. That. She was like, it was insane. She'd be like, Viva Trump! Give me one! Lock me up! <laughs> Fuck, mom, you gotta be careful. She's like calling immigration on herself. She's like, I can hit it, you must come and arrest me. Lock me up! So uh, I saw my mom, I'm gonna be moving to Colombia for, uh, for a little while. She's like, why are you going to that sheep fuck country? Mom, oh, aren't you from? There. She said, like, yes, full of shit more people than me. It's not that bad. Later when she's asking Sansa, she's like, We want my shit more country! <laughs> yeah, that's my mom. My dad is cool. My dad is, um, he's also an immigrant, but um, he's a Democrat, so you know, he's cool. Uh, but with him, he has problems with the English language. For example, um, you try to correct them, and he doesn't quite adjust. So, for example, text messages. He calls them Tex Mex. So he'll call me up and be like, hey, did you get my Tex Mex? And I'm like, you sending me nachos now? So I'm like, all right, do I like my Tex Mex? My dad, I'm going to you right now. Gluten free, never really have any Tex Mex. So I said, like, I want some nachos. And then the other one is uh, in Florida, where they live, in order to drive on the highway, you have to have a uh, transponder in the car to so pay the tolls. So he calls me up, he's like, it is it. You want to drive in Miami? You have to have a transgender in the car. Transgender? <laughs> 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 if you talk about transgender in the car, you're going to get trouble. I'm like, okay, daddy, you like coming out to me? Like, what's going on? <laughs> I'm cool. I'm just happy to be in the house. And that's great. I'll watch you learn your truth. You know? He's like, what truth? The truth is I'm not going to pay your picnic ticket, okay? <laughs> you go downtown, you pick up a transgender, and that's it. Since I've been doing this joke, he like calls me up randomly. He's like, "Hey, I said something else wrong today. You want to hear it?" <laughs> <laughs> like, so I went to the Popeyes restaurant and I ordered fried kitchen. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Good, right? Uh, that's genius, man. Uh, fried kitchen. Wow. That's gonna be my kind of special. <laughs> fried kitchen. <laughs> And uh, well, my dad, you know, he's been in this country a while, but he's, I wouldn't say he's that woke. He, he kind of makes things a little awkward sometimes. Um, you know, it's nothing really, it's very innocent, but like, for example, with black people, he likes to talk black to them. And he feels like that's cool, like his way of connecting to them. But I think the last time my dad had a black friend was like in the 70s, because <laughs> for some reason he turns into Shaq. <laughs> So he goes like full 70s job turkey, like when my friend Steve would come over and be like, hey, what it is, my sword, brother? Hey, what that shit, brother? And I'm like, man, you can't canceled, man. You can't do that. Come on. It's Wakanda forever. Come on. He's <laughs> like, what is this Wakanda? Is that Wu-Tang? I'm like, no, man, Wu-Tang is this one. But sorry, stay with the shack. It's all good. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, they, they want me to, they want to get married. Um, I started dating somebody recently. It's, uh, it's going great. We've been together. But uh, we have a bit of an age gap. We're uh, 20 years apart, two decades. So, anyone else deal with that? No? But, uh, you know, she calls me daddy. So, uh, <laughs> it's, uh, it can be awkward at times. You know, we got at the quinceanera. That was my kind of life. <laughs> I, think, um, I think for her, she likes older men because she feels like we can teach them things. You know, like, for example, I taught her how to ride a bike. <laughs> Like fractions. Uh, we're at that stage where we're like farting now, you know, the beginning is kind of cute, you know. You fart? No. You know. But, uh, but you know, now I, I told her, uh, I, I actually was the one who grew up, you know, I love you. I was like, you know, I love you. And she just went. So, <laughs> she didn't say it back. I don't know. And uh, she's teaching me TikTok dances. It's kind of fun. If you guys see any TikTok dances, you have to go like that. The problem is, I'm getting old, so I'm like, my hips kind of get out of it. But yeah, so that's my time, guys. Thank you very much. Woo!